Hello, it's Richard from Tyne Valley Aquatics, and this is a review for an Awazi Filtral 5000 UVC. It's basically an internal filter which contains a pump, filter, and also a UV light as well. It's an all in one device for keeping small ponds clear. The basic workings of this filter are water is drawn through here, it's filtered through foams, it passes over bio balls, which are basically just balls of plastic shaped, and then it's passed out over a UV light, which kills the algae, and spat out back to the pond. This can be fed up to a small cascade, so you have your pump stroke filter in one side of the pond, feeding up to a cascade returning to the other side of the pond, so you get a good turnover of water. The UV bulb in here is an 11 watt one, so it's plenty big enough for up to a thousand gallons uh, if you've got no fish, but the the unit itself actually says will treat water up to 5,000 litres, which is just over a thousand gallons. Um, if you have fish and the ponds in sunlight, you can half that. So in effect, in a normal sort of pond, which most people have, they've got a few fish, it's in some degree of sunlight, it effectively will treat 2,500 litres, which is approximately 500 gallons. The unit is also available in a smaller version, 2500. Again, if you've got fish and it's, you've got any sort of sunlight hitting your pond, effectively it'll treat 1250 litres. So the smaller one, 1250 litres. The bigger one, which is the first one I showed you, the 5000, effectively 2500 litre pond. One interesting feature this unit has is an attachment under here for an airline. If you've got an air pump, you can feed an airline down into here, air will bubble up inside the unit and it'll increase the biological activity in there. The bacteria that lives in here thrives in an oxygen rich environment, so it, it just gives the filter a little bit of a boost. One great benefit that this particular unit has over the equivalent hose lock all-in-one filter is it's not very tall, so you can put it in shallow ponds. The unit comes with a three-year guarantee, which is pretty standard for most pond pumps and filters. Maintenance-wise, if you notice that the flow was slowing down, coming down your cascade, or if you had a fountain attached to it, you notice that the fountain wasn't coming as hard as it should. You take the top off, remove the foams, you got a, a coarse blue one there and a fine black one. Give them a good wash out, ideally in pond water to maintain some of the, the bacteria that will be living in here. You know, give them a good clean out. Take out the little bags of gravel, wash them out, again ideally in pond water. Take out these little bio balls, or more so bio wheels as they are. Again, rinse them in pond water. Put everything back together and set it away. The foam that's in here is a nice big coarse foam and it has a great big surface area so it should be a long time before it needs taking to bits and cleaning out. The unit does have an indicator light here, so even under your water, because the water should be clear, you should be able to see a blue light shining if the UV is working. If the UV light goes out for any reason, obviously remove the unit, pull it to bits, check the bulb, and if necessary, change the bulb. Ideally, the bulb should be replaced every year. Um, we always recommend doing it in the spring, because really the light will shine it, although it'll shine for many years, it'll only shine brightly enough to effectively kill the algae for six to nine months. 
So if you replace it in the spring, it's at its brightest through spring, summer and autumn, dying out a little bit in the, in the winter, which doesn't really matter because algae tends not to grow very much in the winter anyway with the, the lack of sunlight and also lack of nutrients. I've used these on many ponds over the years with great effect and can wholeheartedly recommend them.